Trivia shows are widely popular, so naturally there will be fans that give them grief regarding what was accepted and what wasn't accepted as an answer. So today, I want to take a look at The Chase, Season 3, Episode 11 that aired this January, where we have an inconsistency between two music-related questions. So let's break down a German word and a Greek mythology goddess. <laughs> It's no surprise that a trivia show got something wrong, it isn't the first time and most certainly won't be the last, it happens, but it gives me something to talk about and educate you all on the truth. In one of the opening cash builders, this question came up. What is the German word for a short recurring musical phrase used to create mood in film? A uh, motif. More specific. Le motif. Correct. Despite being deemed incorrect here, motif and leitmotif are used interchangeably. And given the question did not specify that it signified a person, place, or thing, but rather mood, either motif or leitmotif would be correct in this context, especially when looking at the definition in music terminology dictionaries. Now, I have no idea what the difference is that the showrunners would say, and even in the music analysis world, I'm not even 100% certain what the difference is thanks to their usage being interchangeable in many places. So, here's my guess. A leitmotif is only a few notes, or perhaps some kind of musical gesture. That can be easily slipped in, and you would only need those few notes to know what it is. A motif, on the other hand, would be similar to a full-out theme, which isn't just a few notes, but melodies, with perhaps a structure. Take Jurassic Park, for instance. There are three confirmed motifs or leitmotifs. I use this as an example because of the few number there are, and it's incredibly to see what the differences are. The island and dinosaur themes or motifs are long, but the predator leitmotif is only four notes long. Now for the other question that they said was correct, but technically incorrect. The constellation Lyra represents what musical instrument? Harp. Correct. Seriously, look up any image of Lyra and find one with a harp rather than a lyre. Technically, these are two different instruments. One is small and sits on your lap, and the other is massive and requires a set of wheels to be moved around. When you look up information about Lyra, it does include the harp, but that's technically wrong and kind of my point. Here's another example. Have you seen marching bands with a little music on this thing attached to their instrument? Those are called lyres because of the shape and the design. And since we haven't really used lyres widespread in quite some time compared to the harp, why aren't these called harps? If harp was an acceptable answer here, then motif should have been accepted as well and he should have been able to bank an extra 10k from knowing the next answer. Of course, this all didn't matter, because in the end, even with the boost of the harp answer accepted, they were still caught by the chaser and left with nothing. But of course, you aren't left with nothing, because from this video you got a little bit of education and knowledge about motifs and lyres.